Hi friends, welcome to Daring Mariner YouTube channel. Today we will discuss about India's first international maritime service cluster at Gift City, Gujarat. Why is this in news? The state run ports operator and regulator Gujarat Maritime Board GMB will set up India's first international maritime service cluster at Gift City, Gujarat. GMB's initiative aims to provide a one-stop solution for the entire maritime fraternity. GMB has been trained to develop such a cluster through its subsidiary Gujarat Port Infrastructure and Development Company Limited GPIDCL. Let's look about the cluster. While the project was conceptualized back in 2007, it received in principle approval from the state government in 2015. This will be a first of its kind commercial maritime service cluster in India which has been conceptualized to enhance the competitiveness and self-sufficiency of India in the maritime sector and provide a one-stop solution for the entire maritime fraternity. It is conceived as a dedicated ecosystem of ports, maritime shipping and logistic service providers. The cluster looks to host maritime industry players including regulators, government agencies, maritime shipping industry association and business, intermediate service providers such as shipping finance, marine insurance, maritime arbitrators, maritime law firms, among others, and support service providers such as maritime educational institutes. GIF City provides us with seamless environment to create a robust maritime fraternity and strengthen its value chain. GIF City has state-of-the-art infrastructure and world-class banking facilities and institutions that will be beneficial for fostering innovation, economic viability, collaboration, and business opportunities for the cluster. Let's look what the maritime cluster looks like. Regulators and trade associations support service means maritime education, research and media. Intermediate services that means insurer, insurers, legal advisors, consultants, banks and financial institutions, ports, shipping and logistics related business. What are the significance of this project? Attract maritime investments. The main aim is that the project will try to bring back business that have migrated over the years to foreign locations due to the absence of the right ecosystem in the country. Large corporates like the Aditya Brilla Group and Tata Group tap clusters in Dubai and Singapore for their maritime needs. Economic of scale The Gujarat has a lot of ports and handles 40% of the country's cargo, but it has not targeted the entire value chain as a result investors look abroad for the same. Dispute Resolution An alternate dispute resolution ADRs Center will be set up under the aegis of the Gujarat Maritime University, which will come up at the Maritime Cluster. A center such as this does not currently exist in India. Will help resolve cases revolving around the Bangar dispute, ship sales, shipbuilding, and repairs commodities. It will provide an option to Indian players seeking to avoid availing the service of international alternative dispute resolution hubs, which will entail huge cost, time, and travel. The concept of maritime clusters is new to India, but these clusters have been driving some of the most competitive ports of the world like Rotterdam, Singapore, Hong Kong, Oslo, Shanghai and London. Thus India must ensure a significant footprint in global supply chains of the world with the help of such innovative ideas. Let's look about Gift City. Gift City is India's first operational smart city and international finance service center that is IFSC. It is an emerging global financial and IT service hub a first of its kind in India, designed to be at or above par with globally benchmarked business district. It is supported by state-of-the-art infrastructure encompassing all basic urban infrastructure elements along with excellent external connectivity. Gujarat International Finance Tech City that is GIF City is a business district near Ahmedabad in Gujarat, India. It is India's first operational greenfield smart city and international finance service center which the government of Gujarat promoted as a green field project. The city is located on the banks of the Sabarmati river and is around 12 km, that's 7.5 miles from Sardar Vallabhai Patel International Airport. The city is designed so residents can walk to work and includes commercial and residential complexes. Thank you. Do like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.